Hello, Stacey Murphy here talking about the 14 habits that green thumb growers use to grow lots of food. I used to think that I just intuitively understood plants and that's how I was able to grow so much food. But over the years of teaching people how to grow food, I started to realize what sets apart a green thumb grower. It's not necessarily skills or wisdom, but their habits. So the question is, can you learn to be a green thumb? And I think you can. But adopting the habits that I'm going to outline in this video puts you in the right mindset to learn all the science more quickly on your way to becoming a a green thumb. Habit number eight is to constantly learn. And here's a great exercise for yourself. Write down everything that you think you have to master to grow lots of food. You might need to master soil science, water systems, seeding, harvesting, pest and disease management, uh, creating a crop plan, etc. So on a scale of zero to ten, zero being um, I, I know nothing and 10 being I've completely mastered this topic, rate yourself in all those categories. This will help you identify which topics you may need a class or books or a workshop. And it's easier to learn uh, even more about a topic you already know a lot about. It's harder to overcome that initial momentum and dive into something you know absolutely nothing about. But doing that's exactly what will make you a better grower. So doing this exercise and seeing what you know the least about will give you some tips about what you need to study next. And then track yourself over time in each category and keep creating learning objectives for yourself. Which learning topics do you keep avoiding and why? And how are you going to learn those topics? I'm curious if this resonates with you. Do you see ways you can improve your own growing practice? And if you self-identify as a brown thumb, are you excited to try again? Please post your comments below. Stacey Murphy here. Thanks for tuning in.